hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Illusion Fox Gaming. Today we are doing the quest, The Ballad of Oblivion. Sanson has given up hope of Guidelot returning. In spite of our best efforts, I'm afraid we weren't able to find Guidelo. If he had any intention to return, he would have done so by now. It seems plain we cannot depend upon him anymore. But with or without him, we must continue our mission. I was still hoping to meet Gaidolo, but I suppose the show must go on. Now, the legend says that the Ballad of Oblivion can be found in the skies to the east. Is there another place like the Turning Mist in that direction, Kupo? Truly? Then that is where we must go. We will need to make a brief visit to Cardania to secure the use of an airship to bear us there. Pray, come to the landing when you arrive in the city. Yeah, we can do that, I guess. This is between you and me, but I've actually spoken with Gaidolo, Kupo. Fortunately, he refused to come back, saying that he couldn't bear to face Sanson. I couldn't convince him to join us, but maybe you can. Here, take this with you. It's Sanson's journal. The one he always keep, he's always writing in. I, uh, borrowed it. I thought that might help. If you were to show it to Gaidolo, you'll find him at the summit of Somal. Kupo. I forgot to add the Kupo part. Ah, that Mogta blabbed, didn't he? Hmm, Sanson's journal, is it? It's not filled cover to cover with writings on song. Huh. To this, see this, you'd think him a bard. I've done a lot of thinking since we last spoke. Though he's no bard, Sanson has been on finding the song. Hells, he's keener on it than any of us, and I couldn't understand why, but now I do. Sanson truly believes in song. It's as simple as that. When the heat of the moment, I accuse him of using song as a tool. That was ill done, and I'm, and I'm ashamed of myself. I can't bear to be in Sanson's company. You're off to the Sea of Clouds? Then I wish you luck. I can't go with you. I don't have the right. I need to be alone right now and take a long, hard look at myself. You'd do best not to expect anything of me. That, that That's not the answer we were wanting. That jackass needs to get his ass back over here. Must be downstairs. No, I can't jump over the railing. That'd be most useful if I could, though. Just drop down here and be like, hey, I'm here. Please say I was able to secure the Order's cooperation. We have permission to take an airship to the Sea of Clouds. Oh, joy of joys, I'm so excited. I can hear music from the general direction of the airship. That's not Terry. The Ballad of Oblivion awaits, Kupo. Mokta senses that an eldritch power rests here, and it fills him with dread. It can only be the Ballad of Oblivion. Though this place is abandoned, such structures as remain are reminiscent of Mogholm. If Mugles once lived here, then we are surely on the right track. Let us scour the entire aisle. Okay, we can do that. It's even in the shape of a Mughal. Mughal Island! Where is the sky, Mughal Island? What would you call this place? 
Kupo Island? The stone, it calls to me. The Ballad of Oblivion is here. I've never felt so certain of anything in my life. Hmm, where have we seen such markings before, Kupo? Remember now, this is a sealing stone. Used to seal away baleful beings. You mustn't touch... Too late. The long cold night is ended, banished by my hand, by the hand of a fool. Your dreams are mine to see, and your heart is mine to rule. I sing a song of love, and such love I bear for you. With all my heart I give it, and know my heart is true. As I once loved the creatures who upon this land did dwell, but they cast aside my love, so I sent them all to hell. M my head, nay, my very soul is like to split. What, what is this voice? Resounds through the heavens of Troy's all. Oh, gods, this is the Ballad of Oblivion. And this fiend used it to lay waste to an entire tribe of Mughals. This isn't a song. This is an outrage, Kupo. All this time, the thing I sought didn't even exist. It was I who released this menace into the world. I will vanquish it, even if it costs me my life. Flee this place, the both of you. Who do you think you're trying to impress? Those are Mogta aren't running anywhere, and neither am I. We're in this together to the bitter end. Uh, Gaidalo, why are you here? I'm here because you have known nothing, Saints in the Stiff. I can't well leave you to your own devices. <laughs> Prick up your ears, because I'm not going to say this again. It's the fervent desire to aid our comrades that bestows our songs with power. And no songs have more power than those you compose yourself. If there's no Ballad of Oblivion to be had, we'll just have to create it. Got a point there. Yes, yes, you have the right of it. Let's our, let ours be the song of triumph over a legendary fiend. I like the sound of that. Now then, there's four of us to battle the siren. This makes the song a quartet, eh? This is probably why uh, that uh, Moglin was like, no, 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 you can't go do this on your own. Got a bad feeling about this.
There we go. Whoo, the ceiling stone's back to the way it was, Koopo. You were with us aboard the airship? But there's scarcely room to... Never mind that now. Wherever it was you were hiding, you made us all worried sick. Do you know that? If I didn't know before, I certainly do now. I also know you how hard you've been working thanks to this. Uh, my journal, where did you... Give that back this instant. I need to write my report. Balls you do. We can pose our own ballad with oblivion. That's all you need to write. Hmm, now that I think about it, my superiors will demand more tangible results. But of course, such abilities that illusion master during their journey, they sure, they shall serve admirably. Bob, make up your bloody mind. When I return to Mogcom, I'm going to tell everyone that we create our own, very own Ballad of Oblivion, Koopo. So you're returning, I'd best get back to being a quiver man, and who knows, I might even try to behave myself from now on. But whatever I might get up to, know that I won't rest until I surpass both Jahantal and Illusion. I look forward to the day that you do. Remember, my plan can't su succeed without you. Please send me word when the unit is formed. I'll come and pay everyone a visit. Kupo. Should be the first to know, my friend. And on that note, let's go home. Mock Ogle Island. Upon return to Gridania, I must report to both the Order of the Twin Adder and the God's Quiver. While well, I attend to, to business, might I trouble you to pay v Jahanto a visit? He'll doubtless desire to hear an account of our journey. Thanks, thank you, for everything. I know not when I will be, but I look forward to the day we meet again. Yeah, we'll go tell the relevant people what what transpired. A rousing tale of friendship in the face of adversity. I thank you for watching over Sanson and Gaidalo. When Sanson's plan begins taking shape, he may count on me to aid him in whatever way I'm, I am able. As you, my friend, to explain that your experience have raised your hire, you hire as a bard, as I had expected they would. I pray that you shall ever be a paragon of our art, enriching the hearts of men with song. And so that completes uh, the whole Heaven Sword Bard storyline. I, I would like to thank everyone for joining us here, here today for this little video here on YouTube. Hopefully we'll see you again either for another video on YouTube or maybe one of our mini streams over on Twitch. Till then though, have a wonderful rest of your day.